Today I'm going to show you how to make this hat from 1912. Here are my supplies, including this floppy felt hat that I got from Amazon for $25. And here's the inspiration. Step one is to reinforce the brim of the hat with some 19 gauge wire. This will help to make the hat a little bit less floppy and to support the weight of any trim that we put on it. Cut a little extra wire so that it overlaps by about two inches. Next, we finish the edge using some matching bias tape. Setting the main part of the hat aside for now, we're gonna start working on the bow. I'm going to make three big loops and then one small loop for the knot. I also used a stiff cotton backing for the bow so that I would keep it shape. And this is the point at which I started to become a little concerned that this bow might be way too big for the hat. Before I attach the bow, I'm going to reshape the brim so that it matches the inspiration picture. I decided to just commit to the bow because 1912 really does have a bigger is better attitude towards hats. This part is more of an art than a science. You sort of just artfully scrunch it into place and then stitch it down. And here's the finished hat. I honestly think it came out so cute. 